Hi guys, it's Rachel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing 10 things that you are doing wrong every day. So I took to the internet to search 10 things that people are doing wrong every day. I tried to come up with the most unique creative ones that hopefully you haven't heard before because it's really annoying when people all do the same things. So yeah, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you guys want me to do more of these types of creative fun videos or life hacks or something and make sure to subscribe down below it's just the red button very easy it's free and yeah so without further ado I'm going to show you guys what you're doing wrong every day and how you can change the very first thing relates to people who have a microwave so when you're microwaving your food you want to put your food to the outside of the dish instead of in the middle so let's say you're warming up a piece of chicken or something the inside is going to most likely be cold and you're gonna have to keep it in the microwave for longer if you just put it in the center instead put your chicken and your vegetables or whatever you have on the side of the dish and you will not have that problem ever again The next thing is when it comes to your hair. So you're probably using a regular bobby pin like this one and just putting it like this with the ridges up. But what I did not know is that the ridges actually go down. So when you are putting this in your hair, the flat side will be showing and the ridges will actually hold your hair much better because bobby pins tend to fall out a lot and it's really annoying and that's why because we're putting them in wrong. So there you go. next thing you're probably doing wrong is relating to the shower so when we take showers we normally just wash our hair with hot water because showers are nice and they're warm but at the very end after you have conditioned and washed your hair you want to switch the temperature to cold or something that you can bear without it being super freezing and rinse all your hair until there's no more like warmth in it this is going to close up your hair follicle and give your hair a nice shine so once it's dry your hair will be a lot more shiny so you know those packages that are so so hard to open and they have like the really tight plastic around it that scissors won't even open and it's so hard and they hurt they will cut you if you try opening them they're impossible I found a way that you can actually open these super super easy so you're just going to need a can opener you're going to you know take the edge of it and clamp it down and just open it with a can opener it'll cut it open super smooth and you will not cut your fingers ever again Next time you go to a fast food restaurant, you know how they have those paper little cups like the ones from In-N-Out if you have one where you live um, or whatever burger place. They have little cups, little plastic white cups for your ketchup or mustard and um, did you know that you're actually doing it wrong? There's little ridges in the cups that you're actually supposed to pull apart and it'll open up into a flat surface so that you can dip your burger in it or your fries so much easier and you don't have this little space to dip everything into I'm not a very big soda drinker but if you are this is really going to help you out because you're probably just popping the lid open and drinking it straight out of the can or putting a straw in if you don't want to like ruin your teeth or stain your teeth but that little bottle cap thing that you pop open the can with, you're actually going to turn it around 180 degrees and there'll be a little hole over the opening of the soda can and you can just stick your straw through that and it'll stay in place and you don't have to worry about it falling out or moving around. And it's super, super helpful if you like to drink soda from a can, from a can. <laughs> is really helpful if you wear makeup and I sometimes wear eyeliner but when I do I wear black eyeliner and I don't know if you can notice but it's like a shadow on your eye and makes it look a lot smaller and I don't know about you but I want to look like I have bigger eyes so you want to get a white eyeliner and put it on your waterline um, going to open up your eyes so much you can also go ahead and put it in the tear duct of your eye like 
in the inner corner and it is going to open up your eyes so much more. The next thing you're probably doing wrong is when you go to the bathroom. There is such thing as a toilet lid and people don't tend to use it. So before you flush a toilet, put the lid down and then flush the toilet because that's what the lid is for. It's going to trap all the germs and bacteria because when you flush a toilet, it sprays, it flies everywhere, and it's gonna get into your bathroom, especially if your toilet's near your toothbrush. Your toothbrush is gonna have germs and grossness on it. So make sure to close your toilet lid before you flush because that's very, very important. If you like to work out or if you are into that type of stuff, then you want to listen to music and specifically like pump up like maybe like pop music or something upbeat. It is going to make your endurance so much longer and you are going to be able to work out like 10 times better because honestly whenever I try to work out and I'm not listening to music, I can't go very far, you know, I can't do as much and music just motivates you so much better, so make sure you're doing that. The 10th and final thing that you're probably doing wrong is eating a banana. And normally people just take like that little part of a banana and peel it down, but I mean, if you want to do it the better way, you're going to flip the banana and peel it down from that way. So then you have a little handle where the stem is and it's a perfect handle and that's how monkeys do it. So yeah, let's take it from the professionals because they're monkeys. They know what they're doing. So that is it for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned some new things because I know I did and I thought this video would be pretty helpful to do. See you next time. Peace. You.